Hello everybody and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. <laughs> um, uh, we're gonna go over here, right, to potentially to help the lady here, help Decca. Um, but we're also gonna be running past a Claw Strider site. So I will hopefully be able to acquire my new best friend, the Claw Strider. Who I can now set to aggressive or defensive. Or neutral. I think is another option. I just need to sneak up on it, and I'm gonna feed it, and I'm gonna heal it. I never usually heal my machines. Oh no, is this a? Have I I've, have I already been through here? I have. Yes. Okay. That's a that's a plane I already have potentially. I'm scared. Uh. -oh. <gasps> New friend. Could use shock ammo against that machine. Oh, hello. There's another one. There's usually three. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Oh, I don't know if I actually. I probably don't have the. Dang it. Um. Where is it? I probably don't have. What is, I don't know what it's called. Valor. I don't have enough Valor for that. Dang it. I was going to try to just... I was just going to like run in and sneak in. Mm, let's try from over here. Sometimes there's some tones in the game that make me think a cell phone alarm is going off. Then I have to stop and be like, Whoa. Come here. Come here, new best friend. Overriding that claw strider will make for You're an interesting ride. <laughs> so exciting. Let's see. Come here, friend. <gasps> I'm riding a Velociraptor. Rode all regular mounts. Oh, sweet. Oh my gosh, look at this thing. This is amazing. I'm riding a Velociraptor. This is. Look at the way its stride works. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. How do I go faster? I actually don't remember. Um, that's dismount. Okay. Get back. Come here. Hmm. Dang it. I don't remember how to go faster. I know I can go faster. Hang on, I need to get in an epic place to like take some epic photos. An outpost. Guess this marks the start of lowland territory. Oh! I could resupply before moving on. Hold, hold, hold your horses. Hold your horses, little guy. How do I make you stop? Not just spin in circles. There we go. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is cool. Like, it's cool to just be sitting on it. But, hang on, let's try to, yeah. It's cool to just be sitting on it, but when it's moving, it's even better, you know? Oh yeah, baby. <laughs> look at its look at its freaking toe thing the, the, the like claw they even have that thing the like frontal claw I can't remember the name of it oh my gosh this is cool where's my okay now that I'm done playing around right there look at it walk this is crazy actually all right I will get off for a second and do don't don't go anywhere don't go anywhere Air like blood. You must be the champion. Champion. Not Please, catch a break a from word. this heat. Champion. I didn't champion anything. Your actions are known across the lowlands. You evaded our marshals and our chief. I, for one, am grateful. So I'll tell you what. 
What I see, what I know, I will share. That way, you won't be running blind. In these Appreciate it. I should probably tell you. Tread carefully if you're heading south. One of our settlements was taken over by rebels. And, uh, we haven't been able to carve them out. Okay. They'll shoot you on sight. Thanks for the warning. It'll be interesting to hear what their their phrases are in the lowlands. Sounds like the Tanoth could use a hand getting their Yeah, Yep, 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 yep. There's so much to do. Scout out the camp while I'm what is there. this, a Ubisoft game? Like, oh my gosh, there's so much. Woo, <gasps> give, give me things. Oh, that's it, but oh my gosh. Can launch different types of explosive bombs. Oh. I don't care about that. This is cool, though, that they made an ad a warrior bow with the adhesive. That is really interesting. Um, but, as nice as that one looks. Ooh. Utaru Hardweep. Oh, that's beautiful. I do like that one a lot. I figured I didn't I I did think maybe like an outpost like this wouldn't have a lot, unfortunately. Let me though I can sell Oh my gosh, this is so great. So that 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 la 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 Oh my gosh, I can afford things again. No, oh, I should probably keep the weaves. It used to be before it was like easier. Cause I after a while I was like, I'll just sell the green ones. And maybe I'll get to that point still. I'm just not there yet. Because there's so many it's it's less about elemental and then like melee and ranged as it is about like, I don't know. And the thing is is a lot of these, um, they're, they're pretty low. Like, this is... The blue was kind of like what you would get for greens in the last game. Yeah, they they kind of nerfed weaves and coils, but it's good. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Thank you for the money. I appreciate it. Oh, nice. Let our blade... Okay. Got loads of it now. Perfect. Oh my gosh, you're beautiful. All right. Okay. Accelerate. But there's like a. I swear you can go like faster on some places, or in some ways. Like, how do I? Oh, you want to go this way? How do I go faster than this? Am I about to pass through here? Okay. Okay, I see. They don't... I don't know, maybe I'm just... Maybe I am blind. I think we just... We just... <laughs> I think we just... <laughs> freaking that bird just got black. Light sided <laughs> flew right in front of us. Hang on. Oh, come on. It said, uh, online, it said if you clicked in on the left stick, dang it, you would, uh, you would sprint. I don't know how to sprint. There's gotta be a way. Who are you people? Are you enemies? You're not enemies. Okay, you guys aren't, but those guys are. Oh, okay. How do I, uh, hang on. Those Tanakh soldiers are attacking the rebels. Bet they could use some help. Can I? Can I change your... There we go. Okay. Wow. No, you can definitely attack back, my little friend. Oops, that is not the arrow I wanted to use. Uh-huh, real 
repair damage mount. Repair, repair, repair. Did I fix it? Okay. No, I didn't. Holy moly, it's so expensive to fix you. I'm never doing that again, I'm sorry. Also, hang on, hang on, hang on. Restart, restart all this, these shenanigans. Glory for the rebellions! <laughs> Gotta get more ammo. She's got smoke bombs! Yeah, I do. Tell me you saw which way she went. Ow! Dang, I knew I should have moved oh, elsewhere. I like the tangent. She's I think I'm uh, I think I'm aciding is what it's going on here. Hang on. I'm not designed for this. I'm not designed for this. I wish I could throw traps out, but I cannot. If I could just run around with the traps that I have to place by hand and like throw myself into the middle of the enemy area and like throw bombs around and then run back, that'd be great. And I can do that with the infiltrator thing, sort of. But it's not great. It is, it is, in fact, less than ideal. Let me just... What kind of... These are acid guys? Yeah, okay, fire should be fine. Or shock. Or should I just... Yeah, the blast one is always a safe bet, you know? Let's see what I got. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am out of blast paste. How nice. The thing is, what it's nice to do is, like, set up a kill zone and lure them into it, even if it's, like, by attacking me. You know what I mean? traps up for no reason but when I can't sneak up on them okay I'm going to attempt to do what I threatened which is whoa still in this fight which is running to where the enemies are mostly located unless they're all basically dead Seems like they are. It's just this woman left. Oh. It's just the Velociraptor lady left. I think. Alright. Very nice, very nice. Poor Gabs never saw it coming. Oh, I didn't even I'm not I thought this was Deca's thing. I thought I was like, oh no, we're fighting her grandson but no i just happened to stumble across a fight in my poor little creature i thought i could change it like what it's um like mm, like i could like hook back up to it you know and like tell it to oh wait let's grab ah get up Oh, I should maybe talk to this woman. Where are you at? Oh, you're over there. Okay. There are new animals here in the lowlands for me to look at. Yes, yes. Oh my gosh, what's this? Hair as red as the blight. Wow, that's that's. I knew my eyes weren't playing That's something to say. You're Aloy, Hikaro's champion. My name's Gatak, leader of Fox Squad for the Lowland Clan. Sorry for our unannounced entrance. I'm sorry I walked up on you. Looks like you were well prepared. Lowlanders know how to use the element of surprise to their advantage. So we get the job done. Are you here to take back Fenrise? Fenrise? A lowland village southwest of here. It's been taken over by rebels. 
I assume the chief sent you to reclaim I'm them. not with them anymore. I'm sorry, I'm just passing through. My squad's been cutting their supply lines where we can. But eventually, we'll have to attack the village directly. We could use a soldier like you. So they're more guerrilla people. In the area, I'll see what I can do. May the ten see to it. But before you go, I'm sure Chief Hikaru would hate it if his own clan didn't thank you for what you've done in the fight against Rodan. Oh, thanks. May our next meeting be in victory. What'd you give me? Hmm. It's like still telling. It's like it's like I mounted it, and it's like still being like. Here's what you gotta do, and I'm like, yeah, I know. Me alone. There it is. I was like, I hope I get a face paint for that, and I did. Excellent. <gasps> Another one. <gasps> How many are you gonna get me? Two? Oh, two is great. Usually I only get one. Where am I going? Oh, okay, here we are. Trump, you can do it. This is why I don't like using mounts. <laughs> Off I go. Bye bye. Bye. I'm making good use of this. Guess what you can't do? You can't fly. Just you wait till you get a hold of a flying mount. I'll be unstoppable. Just checking to see if there's any any new animals. Oh, oh geez. Where is she? I thought I was right on top of it. Are we is this you're not an enemy? Oh, you guys are friendly. I thought Fall's Edge had fallen, but no, okay. I thought it was an enemy encampment, but apparently not. This is cool, though. It's nice that I'm also walking up on it, like, um, in kind of like a foggy darkness, you know? It's extra. Extra spooky. All blades against the Oh, that's the game. Someday I would like to play the game. If it's a board it's game. Edge. Like I should be waiting for me in there. Yeah, but also, you know what also is in here is goodies. Goodies are in here. Hey, it's Akaro's champion. It is. Are you talking to me from up there? Now that wasn't bad. How do I? Uh, okay. Stuff. Oh, you're cooking. I don't care about cooking. Nope, nope, nope. I want. Before I freaking do anything, I want to find a hunter. You're up here? Okay. You defended the cool. Strike true as the tech. Okay, fine. Since you're on the way. An honor champion. I'm Nako. Have you been out to the Valley of the Fallen by chance? Don't think I have. Why? What's there? My idiot little brother. The valley is a test of endurance and skill from my clan, the Lowlanders. But it's been closed for months. Commander's orders. There have been reports of strange lights off the coast, and the whole area is crawling with deadly machines. But Dax, reckless and bare-armed as he is, went in anyway. Oh, unpainted. Never takes no for an answer. Convinced two others to go he with him. He wants to earn his. They've been missing for days, paint. and now Marshal Ivira has been sent in to bail them out. Strange lights, deadly machines, and missing soldiers? Sounds like a lot, even for a marshal. I'd go by myself, if I wasn't stuck on transport duty. I'll find your brother, if I can. Where is this valley? South of here, towards the coast. Look for the climbing path on the cliffs. It marks the start of the valley. And if you see my brother, knock him on his ass for making me worry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tough love, I get it. We're a tough love kind of place. I get that. Strange lights off the coast. That sounds cool, honestly. Whatever it is, it can't be good. I should look into it when I'm out that way. Oh, this is so interesting. Seeing like the different architectural styles for the clans is so fun. Do you have goodies for me? I'm so excited. No, you don't have much of anything, but you do have this. <laughs> what is this? 
Shield wires and explosive trip wires can be upgraded to use advanced trip wire explosives and deal extra damage against unaware enemies. <gasps> Seeker hunter bow can be upgraded to use advanced frost hunter. There's advanced versions of the elemental arrows. Oh my gosh. What does a shield wire do? Uh, what do I have? <sighs> okay, so it would upgrade that one, which would be fine. I mean, I keep not getting myself fun things, so... I was kind of hoping to get a trip caster that would, like, have... The fire and the electricity and the blasting and I'm pretty sure I have seen that um, but if you want to give me something new I don't know what it does a shield oh my gosh could I like use a shield wire to put in front of me like I do with the trip what the trip wires anyway and then like something will run into it and it'll stop them and then it'll explode because it obviously has some sort of explosive capability let's get it Buy and equip that sucker. And I will sell. I wonder if you get extra money for having um, upgraded it. Or if this... I, I hope you... I kind of hope you do. Because otherwise, like, that's why I was, like, I was really hesitant to upgrade my stuff. Because I was, like, I'm just going to get better stuff eventually, you know? But let us... It has a, it has a, it has a, whatever, a modifier in it, but I'm not really worried about that. Oh my gosh, and I can sell these. Oh, 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 oh. oh, 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 oh I'm doing quite well for myself. <laughs> okay, give me the pop-up for... Yes, thank you. I was like, I was waiting for the pop-up. Shield wire. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's exactly what I want. Shield wires can be fired from certain trip casters to generate an energy shield between two points. The shield will block all project. Oh, Outlander. dang it. It doesn't do what I want it to do. Will it will today? block all projectiles or explosions, but it cannot stop physical attacks. If the shield absorbs too much damage, either from you or your enemies, it will explode. So I can't be in its vicinity very long either. <laughs> or it'll explode on me. <laughs> Dang it, I was really hoping that it would um, be something that could block a charging enemy. Alas, alas. This is still cool, though. This is actually cool, and the picture looks really interesting. But this is not stealthy. This is like me putting up... This is just me putting up barricades that I can fire fire behind, you know? And it's not even a... I was kind of, yeah, because it would have been nice if something had, like, impacted it and exploded. But instead, it's just, like, if it takes too much damage. Oh, that's a bit of a bummer. But it's okay. It'll be interesting to play with and see how it does. Let's see. I think I can modify it. Oh, it's not... Oh, I can just do modifications whenever. But I probably... Yeah, let's do this one. Okay, can't do that one. But we got the first upgrade down. I have an elite. Oh no, she. Oh. Interesting. So if I bought one of these, would it then essentially give me the recipe? for it that's very cool i am very broke i just bought a bunch bought some resources i bought i pulled Tiny stuff out of my stash work. still but holy moly i freaking spent so time. much money look at this look at this this is cool i need a better rope caster that's what i need too oh i would love to freaking mess with these right now but i'm gonna have to wait till we're actually in combat of some sort I see you have you have stuff in here for me to listen to, and also takes to knock youngster. Is that you? You are definitely definitely not a youngster. 
Oh, it's just, it's paper. If I, I knew it was going to be a fashion thing. Uh, I've seen more of the world than most, but I can still be blind to the most simple of traps. Regala insulted me again during a meeting with the marshals, claiming that as a carja I could never prove my loyalty to the Nanakt. Citing my service to Kakaro, I asked, what more proof do you need? I knew I had blundered when she smiled. Now I am on my way to perform an ancient lowland ritual trial, an ancient lowland trial in a place called the Valley of the Fallen. Oh, we just talked about that. To get there, we had to travel far to the south of the jungles of Hakaro's homeland. My companions, lowlanders, all quickly embraced the familiar terrain. Their gait intuitively changed. Their steps produced almost no sound or visible marks in the dense foliage. As we marched, they instructed me on how to identify edible plants, how to move unseen, how to set traps, and, even more importantly, how to spot them. And I suspect all these les lessons will be useful in the trial ahead. The last stop before the valley is Fall's Edge. Here I am, astounded. If by yet another Tanakh's way of life, somehow the lowlanders managed to build their otherworldly settlement on the edge of a waterfall surrounded by spearfishers, trap cages, and moss-covered spikes. The entrance feels like the river runs through it, and the far side offers an awe-inspiring view of the falls. It couldn't be more different from the dusty heat of Arrowhead or the chilling heights of Stonecrest. As we dined on strange shellfish and fruit from the jungle that was alien to me, I could only reflect that Tanakh are nothing if not diverse. Tomorrow, I'm off at the trial. The objective is simple. Survive for ten days. Easier said than done, from what I gather. It gives me no comfort that many lowlanders have perished in the tent and they grew up here. To counter that, my companion slapped me on the shoulder and told me that Hikaru ignited his legend by staying in there for three whole weeks, as if that's any consolation. <laughs> oh, what an interesting group. And this is so interesting to see. Like, It's very um, anthropological um, to have an outsider come in and essentially have like won their way or, or, or won the approval in some way of members of the group, not all of them, but certain ones, um, and be allowed to um, write about their experiences as an outsider observing these people who, you know, he didn't really know much about or had a very distorted view on, and now he's he's seeing them for what they are, you know, for like, or not, at least a little bit, he's seeing a little bit of what they are. Um, as much as any outsider can give an insider some insider privileges you know and it's just this reads exactly like some of the like 1800s 1900s um i guess like 18 no yeah, 1800s 1900s sort of um anthropological excursion material where you travel into like you know an unknown place to you and find people and realize that they are far more complex than you potentially gave them credit for, you know. It's just, it's just really interesting. It's very well done. Oh, I do want to go find. Do they not have a painter here? Oh, they don't have a painter. I am traveling very far away <laughs> to go get a face paint done. I want to check out my new face paints. We'll come back, though. We'll come back, Decca. Don't worry. The Conqueror and the Marauder. I think were the ones I got. Dang, I just think I like the one I've got, honestly. I mean, maybe I could switch. I wouldn't mind switching to a new Taru one, maybe, for a bit. We could do that. Yeah, but I also need those key upgrades. Hush you, game. I did, I did inadvisedly purchase something quite expensive. Okay, okay, even the game's like, hey, you're a little broke. I'm like, hey, shut up. <laughs> I know. Man, now I want to see these, I want to see this place, like, in the daytime, though. Beautiful. Like, what I can see is very lovely. Oh, yeah. This is the backside view of the falls. I mean, yeah, this would be an excellent place to set up camp, you know? To set up a settlement right on the water. As long as you didn't pollute the water source, I guess. I'm telling the truth. Listen to him. Cavo? Not a chance. He's a traitor. Oh. Oh. Okay. I did not expect that. Wowza. He's, uh, okay. Hang on. I, I realize. Hang on. Decca, what's going on? Aloy. 
I'm glad you're here. This is Oroke, leader of Fall's Edge. So you've enlisted the Chief's champion in your dull-bladed efforts. You must be Cavo, then. My grandson. And a soldier trying to right his mistakes. Or trying to lure us into a trap. My scouts caught him, sneaking around on the outskirts of the I house. like his face paint. I wasn't sneaking around. I was coming to warn you. Okay. The rebels are planning an attack. I don't trust going you. to send a machine straight through this village. I left my post when I realized what they were planning. You have to believe me. Where are the rebels now? They were hunting for the machine north of here. I, I can show you the way. The only thing you'll do is face trial by combat. You betrayed your clan. Your chief. Blood and blades will decide your fate. I'll fight whoever you want after we stop the attack. You said you defected after you found out about the attack. Why'd you change your mind? When I joined the rebels, I thought Regala was going to lead us into battle against our old enemy, the Karja. But all we've done is kill each other. And for what? Pride? Vengeance? So when my squad leader told us about the mission to destroy this village, I left my post. Don't believe his lies. Anyone who deserted the tribe to join Regala knew exactly what they were getting themselves into. Not everyone. Mm. Why destroy this village? I thought Regala's fight was with Hikaro. Hikaro was a lowlander before he was chief. Unlike the desert and sky clans. We stand behind him without question. Fall's Edge is a strategic midpoint between the Grove and our capital on the coast. It's true. Our orders were to cut off Hikaro's support from the Lowland Clan. But I thought that meant disrupting supply routes, not slaughtering an entire village. If Cavo is telling the truth, this whole village is in danger. We have to find and stop these rebels. The rebels? Built a campfire north of the river, near the cliffs. I can show you the way from there. I can find it myself. Okay. Oh no, I can do Open it. it up, we're okay. Oh no, no. No. I won't give him the chance to escape. The traitor stays here until his trial by combat. Then I invoke blood for blood. I will take Cavo's place until he returns. Oh snap. You're making a mistake, Chaplain. The clan needs your guidance, not the lies of this bare armed boy. The right has been called. Cavo will go with Aloy. Then I'm going to. If the boy speaks truth, you'll need my blade. If he lies, I'll run him through. I must make arrangements here first. Then I'll bring the boy to the meeting place. Snap. Fine. I'll Whoa. see you there. Whoa. Whoa. I yeah, I I mean that that's a that's that's I could see that happening, right? Like a blood for blood ritual, like an exchange of like family and family. I don't trust this kid. I know that he he's like, like has he like tied the woman to the post himself, and he probably had to do that in order to like you know be like you know oh yeah I'm totally I'm totally with you guys, but like he also like he did it, you know like he if he didn't do it he would die, but like still like they probably would have killed him on the spot, but like still like he was fine with killing his relatives and you know his clan. Until very recently, apparently. Like, I don't know. I don't trust him. Anyway, I have no idea how long this episode is. Uh, hopefully it's okay. This guy is attractive. I like him. And I want more face paints like this. Um, he has a little bit of paint on his arm. Don't be so judgy. But um, I also want an armor. Like, I saw the other woman was wearing an armor like this. Please let me have an armor like that. I need, where do I, sometimes you can just pick armors up from chests, so I'm like, wow, where do I get these armors? <laughs> wow. Uh, maybe if I go to the capital, I'll be able to get some cool armor, but I don't have any money. I don't know how to make money in this game. <laughs> I keep buying things. <laughs> but thank you all so much for joining me. I appreciate it. Really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, but to especially Reese Galito, my sapling tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. And an extra special shout out to my tree tier patrons, Christopher. Thank you so, so much for your support. You're the super bestest, and I super appreciate it. And a shout out to Adam, my other tree tier patron, who is also the super bestest. And you guys are super nice, and I really, really appreciate it. So thank you all again, and I hope to see you in the next one.